I think it's actually about to happen. And then this Dalvin Cook topic can be put to rest. Dalvin Cook actually is flying to New York this weekend to meet with the New York Jets. Now, this is going to be weird watching Dalvin Cook sit alongside Aaron Rodgers, a rival for years and years, man. He's actually going to be teaming up with him. I got to say, I think this is going to be a done deal. I believe that the Jets are not going to let Dalvin Cook walk out that building. And I also believe that Dalvin now understanding the market of the running back position, he is going to take what he can get, right? I think they're going to give him probably like 8 million. I think it'll probably be around there, 8, 9 million. I can see if I had to guess. And I think he's going to walk all over that, man. He's going to be like, man, sign me up. Let's get it. Because he also understands that the Jets do have a good chance to make a run this year, man. They got Aaron Rodgers. Their defense looks crazy, man. They got a bunch of young gunners out there balling out, man. You know, I mean, shit, it's a good situation at the, at the end of the day. It is a good situation to go in if you're looking to try to make a run in the playoffs and maybe possibly get to a Super Bowl. You never know, man. You got Aaron Rodgers. You got some weapons. You just never know what can happen. So it is a good situation. But I got to talk about Vikings and Jets history, man. Just a lot of the transactions we've had, right? Like, it's weird that we had the Brett Favre coming to Minnesota from the New York Jets. And then we had Tyler Conklin obviously went to the Jets. We have goddamn Kirk Cousins that he had a deal on the table from the Jets, $90 million. But instead, he picked the Minnesota Vikings and took that lower money, $84 million, and wanted to come play for our franchise. Um, and then there's been other little deals and wheels and deals and things that's been happening between the Vikings and the Jets. And it's almost like... We have a business relationship with the New York Jets. It's almost It almost makes me feel like our side reached out to the Jets and said, hey, you should call Mr. Dalvin. You should give Mr. Dalvin a chance, man. Let him come over there and play with you guys. The guy's a great guy. He's very valuable. And it is what it is, man. But let's see. Tom Pelissero, man. Tom Pelissero tweeted on Twitter. He said, four-time Pro Bowl playmaker Dalvin Cook is flying today to New York to visit with the Jets this weekend. Cook, who averages 107 yards per game in his career, knows Aaron Rodgers from years of NFC North battles. Now they can team up and try to win a Super Bowl. Now, <laughs> it's going to hurt my heart. Like, it would literally hurt my heart for me as a Vikings fan if the Jets won a Super Bowl. But shout out to the Jets. You know what I mean? My mom's a Jets fan. So at the end of the day, she'll be super happy. She'll be celebrating. So in a way, I'll celebrate because I'll be like, man, y'all only won that Super Bowl because y'all got our boy Dalvin Cook. That's the only reason. If it was to happen. I don't see that happening, but if it was to happen, they are in a good position, though. I do believe that they have a good football team. I do believe that this is a good opportunity for Dalvin Cook, and I do believe that this is going to happen, man. I think it's a wrap. You know what I mean? I think it's a wrap after this weekend. I'll say by Monday, Dalvin Cook will be a New York Jet, and then we can move on, and you don't got to worry about R.A.P. doing any more videos about my boy Dalvin. I figured out that I'm a Cook stan, man. I just am. So I had to talk about it, man. Shout out to Dalvin Cook. Hopefully everything works out for him. I am confident in who we have right now as the Minnesota Vikings. I do believe that we're going to make it work with who we got, man. Our offense is still going to be elite. So I'm excited, man. Make sure you hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. We're trying to get the 3,400. We slacking, man. Make sure you're hitting that button. Let's get it, man. Thank you all for the support. Holla at your boy. Yeah. Smooth summer. Who running? I hear them talking, but they ain't gon' do nothing. Celebration, I might have a toast with you. I'm feeling good, I'm feeling great, I'm touring. We ain't taking no losses, we winning. Undefeated, check the percentage.